All musicians miss home, but LRB's Glenn Shorrock wrote a song about it, which did quite well. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Diamantina Cocktail is the Little River Band's third album. It was one of my favorite albums from the project. It was really a breakthrough album for them. Home on Monday is an album track from that whole project. And it was a hit in some countries, but really wasn't even a hit in their native Australia. Was not a hit in the US. But this is a band that's known for quality deep cuts album tracks. And this is probably one of their best. The, uh, the original lyric came from a phone call back home to Madam, who uh, said, you know, when are you coming home, when are you coming home? I've been on the road for four or five months, I guess. Oh, oh don't, don't be angry, I'll be home on a Monday. Somewhere around noon, I don't know. And Guy, my, my roommate at the time said, that sounds like a song. So I just carried on. And uh, then I got with Beeb and he wrote the middle eight. He came up with the idea of going into the, the shuffle in the, in, the, in the middle eight, which it needed. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm very proud of that song. And lots of lots of ladies like it, um, you know, for various reasons. I asked Glenn Shorrock if there was one message he wanted to get out to maybe the radio people, maybe the critics, but mostly the fans in North America. He hasn't been here in a while. The new material, I'd like people on uh, uh, radio or whoever, critics, whoever, just to take notice of what I do occasionally, um, rather than just look at me, me as being, well, not a dinosaur, but uh, well, elder statesman or whatever they, they want to call me these days. Uh, an institution I got called once. I should be in an institution, but I don't think I am an institution. Dylan came up, and I, I'm doing a whole series on Dylan. Is it really true people were saying, yeah, he's a good writer, but he's got a really strange voice. But we saw through that, and then we got to appreciate his voice. What was your reaction yeah. when you first heard him? Same thing. You know, it's a strange voice. But then I listened to what he was singing. Uh, you didn't listen to Womp Bomp Baloo, Womp Balomp Bamboo, and and you know, get into the lyric, did you? No. You got up and danced to it. That's that's what we did. It was rock and roll was a dance craze that but Dylan made uh, made poetry, made it uh, important, made it political. Um, and the Beatles caught on to that as well. And but they took it an even step further and <clears throat> made all those cathedral songs rather than little church hall songs. They were cathedral guys, you know what I'm saying? I've never heard that term before. I've just thought of it. <laughs> Glenn Shorick sings Little River Band is the brand new album. He redoes some old LRB songs, new takes, fresh takes. And his brand new book, his autobiography, is called Now Where Was I? Information at glennshorick.com. We'll have more from Glenn coming up next Saturday. Make sure you comment on our video, subscribe to our channel, and share our videos. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Thank mm-hmm. you.